Wait, normally we use a sharp needle to test the sensory pain. If normally if it's paralyzed here, then the, the, the pain will not be there. You can't feel any pain, even how sharp the... You see, there's no pain. Up to here, there's some... Uh, there's some so this is definitely no pain. Let's turn over the other side. The sensory nerves. Okay. Now, so we'll check with this sharp needle. Only every dog will feel painful. I mean, this is sharp on this needle. There's no pain. Up to here. It's quite serious, huh? Then I use the quite the pinch reflex. You pinch the toe. You pinch the toe. If you painful, the, the the leg will go backwards. But no feeling. That means the the top is definitely spinal injury. Maybe we just press the leg. Normally it's very painful, but nothing. The pinch reflect the coin. Nothing. Nothing. In between the, the paws. Nothing. A bit of pain there. So the right side, there's a bit of pain. Very slightly. Okay, now we compare to the front. Now the front normally you should feel it. You should feel the pain. Yeah, you feel it. This side so. I ah, see. Normally it's normal. Normally they can feel it. And see there. So the front one is normal. And uh, even front one, I just use a pinch reflex. The dog will, will feel it because there's no uh, spinal injury. I can reaction. Okay, that's good. So from here, we know that uh, the injury does not affect the neck area, it may affect lower, lower back. They should give a strong reaction. Ah, good. Okay. So I just can confirm that uh, the injury is lower half. But how bad it is because the vet at the SPC has given a strong dose of uh, uh, steroid. So we have to wait and see. Uh. Okay. Oh, wait and see. But definitely it is. It's more, it's more on the left side than on the right. But both are equally bad. So this is considered a case of paralysis. Uh, paralysis. What paralysis in behind? Mm. Paraplegia. Paraplegia behind. Mm. Not all the four legs, only the two hind legs. Okay, nice.